a friend of mine brought me this jacket. It has a very long and strange leather strap. It goes through these belt loops and wraps around the neck. It is very odd looking. My friend said she didn't like it at all and asked me to cut it. So today I will show you how I managed to remove it. The first thing I will check is whether the two layers of the strap are glued to each other or I can separate them. In my case the layers aren't glued so I can easily fold the edges towards the inside and sew them. I will cut the strap on the line, I am drawing it just to show you better. This line is showing what it should look like. Cut about 1 cm from the seams on both sides of the strap. Separate the layers and cut the leftover pieces from the seams. Fold the two layers and push them inside. Now you have to sew over them. Raise the presser foot, loosen the screw and remove it. This is a leather jacket so we have to use the teflon presser foot or a presser foot suitable for sewing leather. Hold the teflon presser foot with your hand and tighten the screw securely. You can easily damage the bottom of the teflon presser foot so always place a piece of fabric between the foot and the feed dogs. Before you start sewing, make sure you are using a needle that is suitable for sewing leather. The stitch length must be the same as on the jacket. Place the jacket under the presser foot and carefully lower the needle by hand. Start sewing about 1 cm before the opening and make sure you are sewing exactly over the original seam. You can use tweezers to push and adjust the layers. When you are sewing leather you have only one chance to make it right, the needle will leave holes on the leather and it's impossible to hide them later. When you reach the corner, lower the needle, raise the presser foot and rotate the jacket. So 2-3 stitches, make a back tack and remove the jacket from the machine. Now I will show you the final result. You can see it from all sides. It turned out pretty well, I bet you can't tell it's altered. The eyelet will remain, so please don't tell anyone. If you want to remove the eyelet, you can cut the piece diagonally, fold the ends and sew it the same way. That's all for today, thank you for watching, have a nice day and see you in my next video.